Hi, my name's Andrea Muslin and I'm the Director of the Safeguarding Program for the Perth Catholic Archdiocese. A number of years ago, I wrote a resource called Protecting God's Children, a parent's guide to keeping their kids safe. We are now going to bring you story time that complements this resource and every week we will choose a story that complements each of the 10 basket fillers you'll find in this resource. If you don't have a copy of the resource, you can find one at the Perth Catholic Archdiocese website and you can download that free of charge. Thank you very much and enjoy the story. For every child, the rights of the child in words and pictures. Whoever we are, wherever we live, these rights belong to all children under the sun and the moon and the stars. Whether we live in cities or towns or villages, or in mountains or valleys, or deserts or forests or jungles, anywhere and everywhere in the big wide world, these are the rights of every child. Understand that all children are precious. Pick us up if we fall down, and if we are lost, lend us your hand. Give us the things we need to make us happy and strong and always do your best for us whenever we are in your care. All children should be allowed to live and grow and grow and grow until we are grown up and can decide things for ourselves. Max, Zara, Betty, Juan, Suin, Reza, Paolo, Yeah. Yoko, Muhammad, every one of us shall have a name and a land to call our own. Keep our families together, and if we have no family, look after us and love us just the same. Allow us to tell you what we are thinking or feeling, whether our voices are big or small, whether we whisper or shout it, or paint or draw or mime or sign it. Listen to us and hear what we have to say. No one on earth has the right to hurt us, not even our mums and dads. Protect us always from anyone who would be cruel. If we are disabled, either in body or in mind, treasure us especially and give us the care we need to live happily in the world. Watch over us, wrap us up against the cold and rain, and give us shade from the hot sun. Make sure we have enough to eat and drink, and if we are sick, nurse and comfort us. Teach us all to read and write, and teach us well so we grow up to be the best we can at whatever we do. Take care of our earth, the flowers, the trees, the rivers and the seas, and teach us how to care for it in return. All children shall have time to play and time to rest when we are tired. In times of war, do not make us part of any battle, but shelter us and protect us from all harm. Allow us to say our own prayers in our own words, whether in churches or temples, synagogues or mosques, chapels or shrines, or any other place a prayer may be said to our own God, and let us sing and dance and dress in the way of our own people. Do your best to let everyone know that whoever we are, wherever we live, these are the rights of every child. The end.